got this wind! She's the devil's own! I guess I blacked out for a second. Where's Elaine? She flew a wee bit into the woods when we crashed. Then let's get going. We'll find her, then scour the island for the uncursed diamond ring that'll transform her back to normal. I don't be thinking we will, lad. What do you mean? I, I mean, what do you mean, Haggis? This be a mutiny, Captain. We're leaving you. Did I mention that I'm offering my crew a very attractive pension plan? Ah, uh, you did. And the stock options. But we're still leaving. But why, Haggis? Why? Well. I admit being your pirate crew's been a real pleasure. A real pleasure. But we've grown restless. We can hear the voice of the siren calling to us, and she says she'd be wanting us to do her hair. You're going back to being barbers? Aye. We'll be sailing back to Plunder Island just as soon as we can fix the ship. Good luck, Captain Driftwood. It were a pleasure to be looting with you. I guess I'm on my own again. It's a bottle of soothing hand lotion. You'd best believe in that. That there hand lotion be for the rough, dry skin that can often accompany ship repair. Well, I can't pull the cork out with my hands. Elaine looks like she's all right. Hang on, honey. I'm going to get you out of this mess. That ring is really stuck on her finger. They sure are bright. Feel the power of the ancient volcano goddess in Griswold Goodsu presents High Explosive, the most intense showgirl cabaret in the Caribbean. Starring Wilhelmina, temptress of the caldera, nightly at seven. Looks like it was quite a show. It's a big, heavy looking cast iron cooking pot. Hi, I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I'm a... Stop yelling. I wasn't yelling, I was just... Oh, I've got a terrible hangover. Find something to clear my head, and I can talk to you. And keep it down. What was that I... Shh, shh, shh. Just get me the ingredients for a hangover remedy, and I'll talk to you. Pirate Potables. Oh, please stop touching things. Stop that racket! I feel a dark presence coming over me. Hi there. Ah! Ah! Please, keep it down. No screaming. Oh, my head. Hi, I'm Guybrush. And you would be? I am Madame Zima. 
Mistress of the ancient arts, a precognition and augury. Diva of divination. Cool, you're a fortune teller. Ah, that and so much more. Whatever, tell me my fortune. I do not think you wish to hear. There are things of which a man is better off being ignorant. Oh, but I'm already ignorant of so many things. I want to know my future. No, you are not meant to know. I bet you just can't do it. That's the problem. You can't do it, and you're afraid everyone will find out you're just a phony. You know, I could put a curse on you that would make every morsel of food you eat become a ravenous cockroach inside your intestines, giving you the most excruciating death imaginable. So are you going to tell me my fortune or not? I'm not kidding. Okay, okay. What's in the cards for me? Fame? Fortune? Romance? Ah, very well. We will consult the cards. The process of reading the tarot is a very complex one. Each draw of the cards foretells an upcoming event in your life. When assembled, they will tell the story of your future. A future filled with twists and... Ah! Good Lord, woman, stop that screaming. What is it? Is that a good... Ah! It is death. Well, in the tarot, death just means change, right? I mean, it's nothing to get worried about, right? Uh, yeah, sure, whatever you say. Now, please go! There must be some mistake. Read my tarot cards again. There is no mistaking your fate, Guybrush. The cards do not lie. But if you insist, once again, it is death. I'm feeling luckier. Give me another tarot reading. Luck is not involved here, Guybrush. It is your destiny. Whatever. Let's see what the cards say this time. The card says death. Are you sure you're not dealing from the bottom of the deck? Remember that curse I told you about? Okay, okay. Hit me. Death. How many of those cards do you have, anyway? How about giving me one more tarot reading? This is evil work, Guybrush. The fates have conspired against you. And no man can interfere. Your path has been determined. Okay, I get your point. I really do. Just one more time for Guybrush. <gasps> Let me guess. Death? Leave this place. Huh? You are putting us all in grave danger. Your very presence will bring us nothing but sickness, tragedy, and death. Oh, yeah? Well, demon! Demon! Look, a three-headed monkey. Ah! Then the prophecies were true. Where? I don't see anything. He must have run away. This is a very bad omen. 